KX News, putting North Dakota first. Grocery stores in small towns can struggle to stay open, and that leaves people struggling to get healthy, fresh food. Now some lawmakers want to find ways to fix the problem. Fewer than 100 people live here in Driscoll. Even fewer work here, especially after Norm's Grocery closed down a few years ago. It's a huge impact when people have to travel for groceries. They tend to buy all their other products at a neighboring community. This is where Norm's Grocery used to be. You can see a window boarded up, close sign in the window. There's still stuff inside when you peek in that has been left there for years. Now, the post office that was in this building, the cafe next door, they've both been forced to close since then. All that's left here in Driscoll is the bar across the street and a motel down the road. For many in Driscoll, that means a half hour drive to Bismarck to shop, and they're not alone. According to SCR 4013, 15% of grocery stores in towns with fewer than 2,100 people have closed since 2013. And not having a grocery store nearby can be bad for your health. It's a sort of a quality of life issue. Senator Jim Dotsonrod sponsored the resolution and hopes the state will study the issue to find ways to get good food to rural areas. Trying to find food in the, in the quantities and quality that you might normally expect to try to get that into some of these uh, rural areas is, is showed up at a number of different places. It would look at anything from how stores can stay profitable. Small town stores just don't have the volume. To how to keep products on the shelves. They don't move enough fru fruits and vegetables so they can't keep the fresh things on hand. And if the state can help. The Senate's already approved the resolution. If the House does too, the study's results will be presented to the next Legislative Assembly in two years. Well, today, lawmakers